calculate the speed of your character, the easiest is to use the reference to your movement component which should already be set in your Unreal project. So control drag movement component to your event graph. And then from this, look for velocity. You're gonna have to scroll all the way down and have access to that variable. Now velocity is a 3D vector which contains two important elements, a direction and a magnitude. So let's go ahead and print that out to see what we get. As you can see, you have the three axes displayed, and if I start moving around, you'll see that two main components will update the X and the Y, which is the 2D plane on the floor, and if I jump, you'll see that Z also gets velocity. Positive when I'm jumping up, negative when I'm falling down. Now, in order to use the speed, we're gonna have to calculate the magnitude of the vector, or the length. From velocity, we'll simply use a function that is called vector length. Now, let's go ahead and print that again to see what we get. As you can see, when I keep running, I get 500, which is consistent with the top speed of my character. The vector length of the velocity is the speed. We can then promote to variable and name it speed and connect. You now have the speed of your character.